hey guys hope you are fine today i will show you how to create this classic false ceiling it's a very easy process so let's get started as you can see in the picture so here is the section detail so today we are going to start this one let's let's start okay. come to the file then i will select the family first of all i will create the family i will create the profile now for this press u to change the units i want to work in the centimeters you can use any units now i will draw some lines to create the profile i already have the design in my mind what i'm going to make so i will use the same design you can draw anything what you like To trim the line there is a command it's called tr you have to press tr and then you can trim the line. Now I will save this family with the name I will give the name fc it means full ceiling then profile 1 this is a profile 1 the later i will show you i will create one another file okay now i will create a folder save this profile Click okay okay this is already uploaded now here i will delete this unnecessary things in this my project now i want to hide the roof there are two ways either i just select the roof and hide from the 3d view the other way i would like to use the section box uh, here you go the section box just select the section box and drag it down now let's go to the level one false ceiling level one here i will create the component as i told you i will create the custom design so i will choose the component i will give the name fc profile one it's already over there okay let's see give the another name fc profile one okay let's start with the line i need the sweep then sketch path and pick a path i will choose sketch because here i need to give the gap in front of windows for the curtains or the blinds so just draw the line as you can see In these two windows, I will give the gap as well.
okay press okay now I need to upload the profile select profile and there is profile saved here you go so now you can see salary in model select profile now I will bring it up for that just select the profile and move it select the move tool it's not coming disjoin okay now I will give the height drag this section to see now I will create the ceiling in front of this profile for that I will use the ceiling tool and draw in front of this edge the profile now I will draw the lines as you can see I will give the gap maybe 60 something let's see if it will be fine okay okay this is fine it looks fine again I will bring it up because I want to attach this ceiling the top of the profile there is a gap 28 centi so I will bring it up more 28 centi ok now I will create another profile for that let's go to the family new and create a profile again I will change the units upload to the project okay, let's save this profile I will give another name in the ceiling plane I will go to the level 1 edit the file ceiling component and I will add one more sweep I will edit the sketch make a line I will repeat the same process as before now I will upload the file ceiling to this join drag it up this profile I want inner edge of this file ceiling as you can see here in the section now I will select the ceiling right click create similar select the level I will keep it automatic ceiling I will choose the plane ceiling and then I will click 
inside the room and I will adjust the height I will make it 4 meter high click inside the room and check in the section there is a ceiling yeah, it looks more higher I will bring it down to 3.8 meter now it's perfect I will select the ceiling plan now edit the ceiling component and then I will draw one rectangle I will give the offset to 30 centimeter 300 millimeter select the inner edge and draw the rectangle and then I will give one more offset 20 millimeter make a rectangle this time I will make one vertical face to close the ceiling bulkhead now I will adjust the height it has to be attached between the lower ceiling and the upper ceiling okay it's done adjust the section okay now you can see this is the section of this ceiling what I made we will go to the ceiling plan again and draw a camera from one corner to another here you can see inside perspective view so this is the ceiling let's change the graphics display here you go so this ceiling project is complete I hope you like this video if you have any question please write down below the comments I will try my best to give you an answer thank you so much for watching we'll come back soon with a new video